And a fiery car crash today on Highway 1 in Gonzales. This video taken by Lori Lenhart, a Central Coast woman credited with rescuing the man from that burning car. Action News reporter Christopher Salas spoke with her. She's, he's live here now with more. Yeah, and this video right here, this is the moment Lori told me CHP was just arriving on scene and moments after she pulled that man out of this car. This was so meant to be. It is just blowing me away. Lori Lenhardt says she was halfway through her shift as a nurse at the community hospital of the Monterey Peninsula. My stomach was hurting pretty bad. I was just, I go, you know, I, I don't feel well. I, I think I'm sick and I need to go. But work drove home with her. While riding on Highway 1 to her home in Greenfield around 4 in the morning, she pulled over after she saw a multi-vehicle accident in Gonzales. It happened just minutes earlier. I was running toward it and I noticed that the wheels were still spinning and the engine was revving like wide open. So I hesitated for a second about halfway and the engine stopped. And as soon as the engine stopped, that's when the flames started. Lenhart said the passenger side caught fire and she ran to the driver's side to see if anyone was inside. He was conscious and he was alert and I said, are you okay? Are you hurt? And he's like, no, I'm okay. And I said, well, we need to get you out of the car. It's, it's on fire. But there was one problem. The door was jammed. On the count of three, you're going to push and I'm going to pull. And we just worked together and, and we wrenched that door open. And we just walked arm in arm about 50 feet away. And then when I looked back, the car was completely burning. Once they were a safe distance away from the flames, Lenhart checked the man for injuries. I didn't really have a plan. It just kind of unfolded. Where other people panic, I, I think nurses, that's when we get zen. We get in our zone. The CHP arrived minutes later, and they were able to put out the fire. Luckily, everyone walked away with just minor injuries. But Lenhart says she dreads thinking of what could have been if she wasn't there. I know things lined up the way they were supposed to. Anything had changed, it would have been a totally different outcome. And Lenhart tells me she did not get the man's name, but Dan Aaron, she's just glad he's okay. Yeah, he's Story. lucky she was there, yeah. All right, wow. thank All you, right. Christopher. Thank you, Christopher. The accident, the first of four that happened on that same stretch of roadway in a span of two hours this morning. CHP says when you see emergency lights, please slow down.